Haryana Chief Minister ML Khattar has expressed grief over the brutal murder of DSP Surendra Singh, warning strict action against the culprits. That's the word coming in. Chief Minister has also made a statement after the word that came from uh, the State Home Minister. Multiple ministers and cabinet uh, have been making statements about it. My colleague Anshul Singh, who's on route new to get us more details from the ground, is joining us on the broadcast. Anshul, give us the kind of statements that have come out. Manohar Lal Khattar has put out a statement on social media. Uh, so yes, that's right. Manohar Lal Khattar has finally come out and give uh, and put out this tweet where he has said that the investigation will take place in the right direction and the culprits would be nabbed at the earliest. Also, what we are picking up that for the next of kin of uh, D uh, DSP Surinder Singh. Also, what we are be, uh, what we have been told that the DGP of Haryana has been told to come himself here at the spot and know where the incident happened. We have been told that a DGP will be uh, reaching there in the next few minutes. He will. allotting the case to the other senior officials so that uh, uh, so that there are no discrepancies in the investigation the basic message that they want to give out is that the haryana government is absolutely uh, absolutely true and is uh, trying to make sure that the culprits are nabbed at the earliest because uh, we have seen that uh, since this incident has happened the haryana government is definitely on uh, where we have seen the people from the congress party as well as the awami party have already come out and yeah. tweeted and made statement against the government so yes the government is under a lot of pressure and yeah. it is now up to them to make sure that the that these people who uh, actually went ahead with this incident should be nabbed at the earliest time and rightly so anshul strict action should be taken please stay with us on the broadcast there's some more breaking news which is coming in uh we also want to uh, cut across to some live elements which are coming in my news 18 colleague is on ground zero let's listen in As I told you earlier, that the government uh, is taking swift action. The Haryana Chief Minister has announced one crore compensation for the family of the slain DSP Surendra Singh. One member of the family will also be given a job in the state government. Some reactions coming in on the story. My colleague Anshul is also reporting from the ground about this. Let's listen into the reactions that have come in so far. My colleague Anshul, uh, tracking all the details from the ground. Anshul, I'm coming back to you. You spoke to multiple ministers, and you know we've been getting reactions from the opposition, the Home Minister and the Chief Minister. Uh, compensation to the family, awarding or giving a job to one of the family members. What are the other key steps that the state government is taking? Uh, so yes, this is a basic SOP that generally is followed by the by the government when something something incident like this, when an untoward incident like this happens. Uh, so yes, Manohar Lal Khattar has just a few minutes ago announced that a compensation of rupees one crore will be given to the next of kin of uh, DSP Surinder Singh. Also, a government job will be given. What rank? What rank of that job will be? That is still not very clear. Also, Manohar Lal Khattar has come out and said that he will be. Uh, treated as a martyr the status of martyr will also be given to him because remember it was just 3 months left in his retirement and this morning itself uh, we spoke to his brother as well of the record and his brother has said that this morning itself he spoke to him and had asked him to come to his home in hisar and uh, dsp surinder singh has had said that it is it's just 3 months left after which i'll come and uh, stay uh, stay with you so yes the uh, family is in absolute absolute shock as of now they are demanding that the stricter action should be taken against the culprits as of now because remember the area in which this happened uh, the location on which this uh, this uh, incident happened that area is in famous for uh, for uh, land mining and the land mafia has a huge huge uh, control over the entire area and this is not something new uh, uh, that has happened or or the police raids that have happened uh, the uh, the the uh, surinder singh trying to go ahead and trying to stop that vehicle this is not something new or out of the blue that suddenly happened but this area is in so much uh for for land mining there have been various reports that we have been getting from uh for past many years also the locals yeah. have been complaining about illegal land mining happening in that area at that point in time the government did not get uh, very active to try to stop this mafia and try to get this mafia uh, in their control now but now since such a big incident ha has happened that the dcp has been run over by a dumper mm. and the dumper was carrying illegal rocks that were mined from there yeah. so the government yeah. is under a lot of pressure right now and they are trying to make sure that the right message is uh, is being given out by them Absolutely. the right tones are being sung by them but yeah. the opposition is not letting this go anyway anyway soon that these sujewala himself had come out and had uh, made allegations against the 
BJP government, Manohar Khattar government, that they were in a difficulty in providing security and making sure that uh, such thing does not happen in that area, which is already very intense right. uh, for land mining. And uh, Anshul, I'll, I'll keep Kivala. coming back to you as you're getting us all the latest developments from the ground. Uh, these are shots of the family members. We are just going to play play them out on the screen. As you can see on the screen right now, those are the bereaved family members who are clearly in shock. The officer was uh, set to retire in three months. And then this brutal killing happens in broad daylight. Clearly, this is a chilling message that the sand mining mafia or the mining mafia in the state is trying to send to the law and order administration and the machinery. The state government says they will respond to this message coming in from the criminals. Uh, adequate compensation, uh, a job for one of the family members, all these SOPs have been followed, that, that has been announced. A statement from the Chief Minister and the Home Minister has also been made. Um, as we get you these latest visuals, there's also a reaction coming in from Haryana Home Minister Anil Vij. Let's listen in. नहीं नहीं बिल्कुल अपराधी पूरी तरह से यहाँ पर निरुत्साहित हैं कोई ऐसी वो गतिविधियाँ सामने नहीं आ रही हैं और पूरी तरह से हमने उनके ऊपर रखी हुई है अभी जो मुसे वाला गैंग के साथ जो आदमी थे वो हमारी एसटीएफ ने पकड़े हैं हमने पकड़े हैं वो हमारी पुलिस सक्रिय है पूरी तरह से नहीं नहीं पूरी तरह से मैंने आदेश दिए हैं कि पूरी सख्त कार्रवाई की जाएगी जो मूसल शर्मा जी है वो कह रहे हैं कि यहाँ पर माइनिंग नहीं हो रही थी पत्थरों की चोरी हो रही थी लेकिन अगर कहीं चोरी भी होती है तो क्या उसे रोकना कानून व्यवस्था का काम नहीं है नहीं नहीं अब इसमें हमारी पुलिस जो ये हमारे डीएसपी की जान गई है ये रोकते हुए ही गई है रोक रहे थे इसीलिए गई है नहीं नहीं साथ उनके पूरी टीम थी पूरी पूरी टीम थी नहीं रेड करने गए थे रेड करने गए थे और सारी हमारी वहाँ पे पुलिस है और अब सारी पुलिस वहाँ पे पहुँच रही है और पूरा चारों तरफ से हम किसी को बख्शे डीजीपी साहब वहाँ से नजदीक ही हैं वो पूरी स्थिति पर नजर रखे हुए हैं नहीं वो सारी स्थिति की हम जानकारी ले रहे हैं वो जल्दी जानकारी लगता नहीं कि यूपी की तरह यहाँ भी थोड़ी शक्ति करने की जरूरत है नहीं नहीं आपने बुलडोज़ पहले भी इनकी कार्रवाई करी और काफी वहाँ पे जो इसके बाद यहाँ भी अब एक काफी लोग हैं आहत हैं इस बात को लेकर वो कह रहे हैं कि अब हरियाणा में भी वक्त आ गया कि जैसे योगी का बुलडोज़र चलता है अपराधियों पर वैसे यहाँ पर भी नकेल कसी जाए सख्ती और नहीं नहीं बिल्कुल हम पुलिस विभाग से सैलरीज दी जाती हैं वो पचास लाख रुपया तो वो बैंक देता है और पचास लाख रुपया सरकार देगी एक करोड़ रुपया इसको मिलेगा ना मिलेगा जनता को इस अवसर पर आपको मैं बहुत बहुत शुभकामना देता हूँ और अब अंत में आज जो एक बड़ी दुर्घटना हुई है जैसा हमारे गृह मंत्री जी ने कहा हमारे डी एस पी सुरेंद्र सिंह यही पास के नू जिले में ड्यूटी पर थे और एक किसी खान माफिया के किसी व्यक्ति ने और उनके ऊपर गाड़ी चढ़ाई उनके जंगल मृत्यु हो गई है बहुत दुखद ये घटना हुई है हमारी सांत्वना है उनके परिवार के साथ भी और हम वीर सैनिकों को हमेशा ऐसे मामलों में सबका मनोबल बढ़ाने के लिए भी अपने आप को भी प्रस्तुत करना चाहिए और उस परिवार की भी जिसकी क्षति हुई है उसके साथ भी खड़े हैं डीजी पास साहब से मैंने बात की है तो हमारी जो अलग अलग योजनाएं हैं उन योजनाओं में एक योजना तो पुलिस की अपनी योजना है जिसके अंतर्गत हम सरकार की ओर से उसको कुछ मॉनेटरी कुछ योगदान करते हैं उनके परिवार के लिए एक योगदान हमारे एच बैंक ने दिया हुआ है कि अगर सैलरी का अकाउंट उनके बैंक के अकाउंट में होगा तो उनको मिलेगा एक बेनिफिट उनको शहीद का दर्जा अगर मिलता तो वो मिलेगा और कुछ पुलिस की ओर से अपने जो वेलफेयर फंड भी जो है उसमें से भी योगदान किया जाता है तो मैंने सब हिसाब लगा के जब जानकारी ली है तो हम शहीद सुरेंद्र सिंह के परिवार को एक करोड़ रुपए की राशि सब उसको